Hey everyone, how's it going? My name is Zach Cox, and today what we got for you is quite possibly the most saddest and like heartfelt Easter egg in all of Grand Theft Auto 5. And this is something that has quite possibly been around for a long time and you guys might not have known about it, but I just discovered this the other day through another YouTuber friend of mine by the name of Wizzle, as well as through a very old Kotaku article from 2015. And it's just cool. GTA 5 is over three years old at this point, and me personally, I'm still finding Easter eggs that I didn't know about before, and I have so many hours logged onto this game, and just so many hours logged into researching this game, and we're still finding out new things. So that's really cool. And what this Easter egg is, is it features a dog, a Sky Terrier to be more specific, and if we head over to the Vinewood Cemetery and we walk in here, each time we walk into the cemetery, this Sky Terrier, he's gonna spawn in, and he's just going to follow this path up to a gravestone. And he's going to go here. He's going to sit down and pretty much guard this gravestone of what we could guess is maybe this dog's former owner who passed away, of course. So that's very interesting. And say we leave the cemetery and come back, the dog will despawn from the gravestone only to respawn in at the entrance and walk back up the same path to the same tombstone and just sit there and guard it and each time it spawns in sometimes it might spawn in a different color or it might just have a different colored collar but other than that it's the same dog doing the same thing over and over again so that's really cool and that's not the full easter egg this easter egg believe it or not goes all the way back to 19th century edinburgh scotland and this is really really cool and to be specific uh it has to do somewhere between the year 1860 uh, in 1872 so that's very interesting that was a long time ago and basically what this is is this old story of a sky terrier same dog as the one in gta 5 who became popular for supposedly guarding his owner's grave for 14 years until the dog himself died in january 1872 so this is really really cool now the dog's name was bobby and this story is simply known as gray friars bobby and you guys can find the link to this article down below in the description if you want to read up on it and check it out for yourself but uh, this is pretty cool you know how rockstar took something so simple uh, as this old legend or or story whether it's real or fake or whatever it may be regardless it's still pretty cool it's it's kind of sad you know anything with dogs kind of gets to my heart make it just you know pulls my little heartstrings and I, I mean like even in movies for example i'm i'm more sad when a dog dies than a human dies you know what i'm saying like i think some of you guys out there can relate to me but uh, basically my kind of thoughts and, and theory on why rockstar threw this into gta 5 is one yeah it's just a simple easter egg but two fun fact rockstar north's headquarters is actually located in Edinburgh, Scotland, the same place and town and city location and area, whatever you guys want to refer to it as, um, as this story, Greyfriars Bobby. So that is really, really cool. And I thought I would just share this with you guys because I personally didn't know about it. And I know there's some of you out there who didn't know about this as well. And I just want to share it with you guys because I found it very, very enjoyable. So, if you guys did enjoy this video, learn something new today, or just feel it's worthy of a thumbs up, definitely be sure to do that. Also, be sure to subscribe. That way you guys never miss out on some more video game content on my channel. But with that said and out of the way, I believe that's just about it. You guys all take it easy. Have a safe one. My name is Zach Cox, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.